get to again to some of the issues that were mentioned here. So, so I, and again, we, we I hope we can follow that in the afternoon. Um, can we take the gentleman to, uh, here in the second row, please? Well, thank you. I, uh, my name is Katima for Mekong Institute from the six Mekong countries. I just want to invite all of you to uh, this afternoon session. We have uh, six member countries in the cooperation get out from war in 1992. And two of them are landlocked, Laos and Yunnan, province of China. One is uh, Myanmar got economic sanction for the last 10 years. And we survived, we possible, we so successful. ADB, Asian Development Bank said that this is the most successful regional cooperation, economic cooperation in history of ADB intervention. So I hope you will spend some time this afternoon to listen to us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay, I think uh, that uh, we should probably uh, try to bring this to a close. I'm very tempted to come back to the panel, but it's too late. And so if, if you don't mind, uh, I will not uh, do so. Um, again, you, I hope that you have plenty of opportunity. I know my colleagues were very conscious of that, uh, to network in the, in the breaks. Uh, again, I think we have an, an excellent agenda, uh, very substantive in terms of content. Uh, now that you're talking about the Mekong countries, uh, one of the issues that, again, that was raised, I, I think was, um, Dr. Panji, was the, the question of of accession to the WTO. There are still 15 LDCs that would be going through that process. Uh, those, those kind of issues would uh, benefit uh, from uh, discussions that we would have, uh, the, the topic that we'll be discussing in the afternoon, and we'll be touching on them. We have uh, very good panels today and tomorrow, and uh, we hope that you stay with us. So thank you all very much, and thank you to the panel.